Hello everyone, welcome back to another Photoshop tutorial. This one I'm going to show you how to do an accurate reflection, and we're going to do it step by step. Alright, first step, got an image here, it's a bottle on a white background. Next step, go to Select Subject. We want to select the bottle. Perfect. Now, we're going to go ahead and hit Command J on a Mac, Control J on a PC. That creates a duplicate layer, so we've got two layers now. Take this top layer, hover outside of it on the Move tool, and then just go ahead and turn this around. So we want it basically upside down, just like that. Now we're going to drag it so that the bottom and the top, or the bottoms, are touching basically. So something like that. Okay, good. Let's take a look at that. Yeah, no, pretty good. We'll move it up one more couple pixels. Perfect. Now, making sure you're selected on this new layer, we're going to go ahead now and create a mask. Click the Mask button. Now head over to the left side, grab the Gradient tool, go up to your Gradient up here, and we want, basically, we want the black to white or white to black. Either one is fine. I'm going black to white. I'm going to go ahead and left click now with the Gradient tool, and I'm just going to draw up like this. And when you do that, presto, we've got a bit of a reflective look. Now the last step here, real quickly here, if you're a professional and you want to go really good, what you want to do is you want to go to now Filter, you want to go to Blur, and you want to go to Gaussian Blur, add approximately a 5 pixel Gaussian blur to the image, and boom, you've got an accurate reflection. Thanks for watching.